Hello everybody and welcome back to another plan with me. I am here for my first like Valentine's spread and I am so excited. This is the week of January 29th through February 4th. I am using the Like a Rose kit from Scribble Prince Co. Obsessed with this art. Love Valentine's Day. I mean, I'm such a holidays person, honestly. So like for the most part, holiday art makes me giddy and excited. So I do love Valentine's Day. And I think this art is so beautiful. It's by Kittenish Jess. And I love the way it turned out. Grateful to have an extender on Saturday because I say this every time, but man, these full boxes lately have been so good. It's been really difficult having to narrow them down, but uh, I just am obsessed. I am also using the Scribble Prince Co. foil bundle. I believe it's the one in Orchid. It's Confetti Volume 2. I believe it's an Orchid. It looks so good with this kit, like the purple color. Stunning. I'm obsessed. I love it so much. I also have some underlays from Plana Hannah. I do have a code with Hannah. You can use the code FANTASY15 to save 15%, plus get my cute freebie, which will be changing soon. I just sent her all info, and I'm excited. But these underlays are in the Heart Lollipops, and I got them in her Unicorn Foil, which I have never gotten anything in her Unicorn Foil before, but I'm obsessed because I knew that, like, my core foil, I say that in quotations, was going to be silver for this spread, and the Unicorn Foil is, like, a pink, a silver, and a light purple. And so it's just kind of, like, perfect. It looks so cute. If you watched my haul showing all my Valentine's Day underlays, I kind of went a little like food heavy with them this year, but Hannah had so many great options that I was just kind of obsessed. And I thought the heart lollipops were really cute with this spread. And the unicorn was nice because it, you know, tied in some of that pink and some of that purple. Love it. I did layer it on top of the orchid bougie boxes. I haven't done that in such a long time, but I felt like this pattern was spread out far enough that it just worked perfectly. And I'm obsessed. I really truly am. The bottom washi, ugh, the color. I just love that solid orchid color. It's so pretty. Um, yeah, I have an extender on Saturday. I have that tall box on the sidebar, which is extra freaking cute. I'm obsessed. And then I have the Days of the Weeker from Hannah. They're in silver. They're in font two. Typically for the Days of the Week, I like them to be in font five, but I had a sheet of font two for silver and I think a couple other colors. So I'm just going to use them up. And I think they look cute with this spread. I think this font like looks really nice. And then of course the date numbers are from the foil bundle. The February script is in silver. It is from Scribble Prince Co. I did pull in a couple of the Valentine's Day overlays from Hannah's shop in silver. I mean, I'm always down for a great overlay. So I have the In My Valentine Era XOXO, y'all. What does this one say? Hey, Sugar Pie. And then this um, Self Love Era one on Saturday is from one of like a past freebie. I pulled out a couple different freebies that I had in a couple different foils. And I thought this one was cute. It matched. I think it might be in her new like Violet foil but it kind it does not match the orchid don't let me lie to you it's a little bit more pink but it matched the spread and that is all that mattered to me so I think that's everything for the base I think it turned out extra cute I'm so excited to do the day by day this was a really great week it was low-key though the start of a crappy month but hey we'll get there when we get there right so up first on Monday I did go to work so let's go ahead and pop in a flag for that oh also my nails are botched but I don't have time to paint them right now so I'm sorry about that and then I did have a YouTube binge while working at work I just did restock so it's really easy to just have like whatever YouTube video just kind of going while you're working for work I'm marking it using this Fox and Pip girl with like the standing desk because when I do silhouettes I'm on a standing desk and it works really nicely and this work script is from the foil bundle for my youtube binge i have the youtube laptop here sorry all of a sudden i'm sniffly and this youtube binge script is also from the foil bundle i used so many scripts from the foil bundle it was like kind of nice um for dinner oh okay so we ate out so much in february and <sighs> It's only going to get lightly worse going into March, but we've decided that uh, you'll see, you'll know when you know, but after the next week or so, uh, we are cutting back. So let's all cross our fingers and toes that that happens for us, but we had Panda Express this night. Panda hits like sometimes, like it really does. So we had Panda Express this night. We started watching the new, or did, was this? Yeah. We started watching the new season of True Detective, which it has Jodie Foster in it if you have not watched it. It's good. It's a little bit paranormal, but like, you'll be fine. It's amazing. And then I ended the night by reading. 
I love True Detective. I've watched the first season with Matthew McConaughey and Woody Harrelson. That was seriously, it's like some of the best TV I've ever watched. And we didn't watch any of the other True Detective seasons, which is kind of strange because every single cast is really stacked and we just never watched them. And then we really wanted to watch this new season. Um, so we did and we really love it. And I think we'll probably go back and watch some of the older seasons because it was really great. So for Panda, I have the takeout bag. I have a custom Panda Express script because I go there so often. Oh, and then for True Detective, I have the TV doodle as well as I did get a custom True Detective script from Hannah. This is in her font too. And then for reading, this is an open book doodle from SPC. It's on the multicolor sheet because I think like the edges are in a multicolor color, but to me it's just black and white. So like I use whichever one, honestly. That could be yellow for all I know. And this read script is from the foil bundle. On to Tuesday. Tuesday, one, two, three. Okay, cool. I filmed first thing in the morning. Let's use also a large label for that. I made some wax. We'll use a pattern, like piece of pattern, whatever this is called. And then I did computer work for a good chunk of the day, so I will um, mark that kind of bigger. We'll use a solid label here. These look so cute. Okay. So for filming, I have the planner doodle. I'm sure like when I film first thing in the morning, it's more than likely a planner video or it could be a melting basket, honestly, but I'm going to assume planner. I think it was probably melting. Anyways, now that I said that, that film script is from Hannah. It's in silver. It's from her YouTuber, like collective sheet. I have the shot cup doodle as well as a custom make wax script. I really chose the worst day to film. Like nails are looking absolutely rough. And then for working on the computer this day, I have the computer doodle and I'm using the work late script. I didn't work late, but I like it. And it, it makes sense for me for computer work. Cause I do, I do it all day and I don't want to put work cause then I'll think I'm at work, but I'm not, you know, does that make sense? Probably not. Um, I cooked dinner this night. I made fajitas. It's like one of our favorites. It's so good. Lately I've been making it like tortilla less and we just put it over rice and it's fantastic. I also painted my nails this evening. We watched some more True Detective. They put out the first three episodes right away and then they did an episode every Sunday. So, and it's on Max if you're curious. And then I started reading a new book. I started reading, um, what color did I just use? Um, Assassin's Blade, which is part of the Throne of Glass series. So I'll put that in there. So for cooking dinner, for all my cooking dinners this week, I pulled different ones more with love stickers because they're all so cute. So I started with this one. It gave me fajita vibes. And then this cooked dinner is a custom from Hannah in font two. For getting my nails done or doing my own nails. I have the nail polish bottle from SPC. This nails done is in the foil bundle. For True Detective, I grabbed the TV icon from the foil bundle. Again, that same script here. And then for starting a new book, I have this Ones More With Love new book sticker. It's so freaking cute. And a custom start new book from Hannah and font too as well. Okay, on to Wednesday. God, I feel like we're flying through this plan with me. It's because we are. Um, three, four. So I started the morning off by doing the dishes. So let's mark that. Then I made some wax. I kind of want to use like a quarter box. Sure. And I also then did film. Hmm. You can use this to mark filming. So for doing dishes, I kind of wanted to stray away a little bit from dishing, like dish stickers. And I saw this one, it matched the spread really well. It's from Paper Muse Crafts. I don't know if they're still open, but that is very, very cute. And this cleaning time is from the foil bundle. For making wax, I found these paper and milk. They're candle stickers, but they match the spread really well. So I grabbed a couple of those for the spread. And like I said, it's from paper and milk and my custom make wax. And then for filming, I found this, I don't know where this is from. Maybe Mr. and Mrs. Mint YouTube play button. Couldn't tell you. Here's another film script from that Hannah sheet in silver. I then edited the vlog which takes a bit of time. I cooked dinner this night. I made spaghetti and weirdly enough cheddar biscuits, like the Red Lobster Cheddar Bay biscuits are super freaking good. 
If you've never had them, you should 100% try them. We get them in the frozen section at H-E-B, but I'm sure like Walmart and everywhere else probably has them. Um, then I also, what did I say? Or oh, we watched True Detective and I read. I love good repetitive nights though. Like truly I love them. They make the day like, I don't know, nice. There we go. I was going to do like a bigger thing, but I decided the little thing makes sense because I want to be able to see the underlay. So for editing, oh, I didn't even grab it. I have the laptop doodle and edit script from Hannah from that same YouTuber sheet. Another once more with love little chef kind of munchkin. That same cook dinner script. For True Detective, I grabbed another one of the foiled TVs from the foil bundle. This one's like the flat screen. Same script. And then for reading, I have this Once More With Love Munchkin reading here. We try to watch at least like one episode of a show a night. I feel like it's just so nice just like lay on the couch and cuddle up with Brian and watch like an episode of something. It's just, I don't know, it's like our routine and we both really enjoy it. So, sorry, I'm trying to get comfortable. That's the first half of the week. Let's slide you into the second half. So Thursday, one, two, three, same kind of thing. Or no, one, two, three, one, two, three. Uh, Thursday morning, I did the laundry. Then, oh, I thought something went off. Um, I made wax again. I think I might do another one of these because they're so cute. I had this like perfect, but then I put the foil on top of it kind of funky. So now it's like really having struggles. And then I did pack orders. Let's put that here. So for doing the laundry, I have the washing machine doodle. Fold laundry script from the foil bundle. Sorry, I dropped a sticker. For making wax, another one of those paper and milk candles that last one was in like a light purple this one's in kind of like a more brighter pink the pink doesn't really match the pink of the spread but pinks of the spread like there's multiple but it's like fun with me honestly make wax and then for packing orders i have the packages doodle and a custom pack order script this is from plan with me stickers Boop. very cute okay bottom half i did listing Oh, did we have a new release and I didn't put it in? I feel like we did. Yeah, we had a release and I just didn't put it in. Lovely. I don't even know what we released. Whatever. I'm sorry. Um, listings. We'll use this. Dang, that makes me upset. I wonder what we released. Maybe about... Uh, I don't remember. Um, I cooked dinner this night. I made chicken, potatoes, green beans, a delicious meal, and then I read. Now I'm, like, really concerned. What did we release? I want to look it up now. Hold on. I'm going to go look because I want to know. What was this? February 2nd? Oh, gosh. I have to go. Scroll, scroll, scroll. No, it wasn't Valentine's. Oh, it was Deathly Hallows Part 2 bummer sorry it's all good for listings i have this stick with the plan co gal on the computer it's because i did the release at work so like i'm silly sorry um the listings script is a custom i feel like now that i'm thinking about it i haven't been putting in my new releases like all like at all so i'm gonna go back through all my notes and make sure i'm adding those in um for cooking dinner another cute little chef from once more with love this cook dinner script again is a custom. That looks really good. And then for reading this night, I have the reading scribbler and a reading time from SPC. Okay. Thinking about it right now, I'm like, do I add it in? Do I have space? Yeah, I definitely have space. It was HP part three. So let's go through Harry Potter stickers and see what we got. Mm, or part two, not part three. I feel like Dumbledore matches. 
I mean, to be fair, let's do Hermione because I'm obsessed with her. All right, well, I'm annoyed now. All right, we'll add that in in a second because I have to also grab my new release script, but we'll keep that out. Um, so Friday. Friday, I did orders at work. I'm going to use another flag. I already used that color. Shoot. Let's use a squared box then. Oh, no, no, no. I haven't used this in a while. These are cute. We'll do this to mark work. Dortmund had a game. So I'll mark that in. And then I'm going to mark in our new release as well. Yay. Okay. I'm glad I figured that out. Because that's like kind of sad sometimes. When I forget things that are like kind of important to me, you know? Okay. So for orders, I have the stickers. Making sure I'm still in frame. Doodle. Custom orders script. I always forget about those cute little things. For the Dortmund game, I have just the classic soccer ball doodle, a custom BVB game day script, and then for the new release, like I showed you guys, this is character number 47 from SPC, and I'll put my custom Fantasy Wax new release script in there when I'm done. After work, went on an HEB run with the fam. Eh, yeah, we'll use a pattern box. I'm like, look at my solid, or my solid boxes. I've used two. Um, each of you run with the fam, and then I also just afterwards relaxed on the couch with the family. Like, really didn't do much of anything. It was glorious. And then I ended up going to bed early this night. Didn't read, didn't watch a show. Just was so tired. I just wanted to go to sleep. So that's what I did. Okay, so for grocery shopping, I have the grocery cart doodle as well as the grocery shopping script from the foil bundle oh, looks so good for hanging out on the couch with the fam this is from paper shire i don't think we played games or anything but it's just so cute because it's like a parent and two kiddos and i have the with my love from the foil bundle because they are my loves and then for going to bed early i have a paper and milk little sleepy maru and a custom bed early from uh playing with me stickers okay Saturday is when things got fun. Um, busy, busy day. So I, let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, yeah, we can do this. Three per. So Saturday, we started up the day with doing dishes. <laughs> this one, things got fun. Started it by doing dishes. No, but seriously, I did. Um, and then afterwards, we went to Thinkery, which is kind of like a kids museum type situation in Austin. It's very fun. Um, the kiddos always have a really good time. I'm actually going to mark it a little bit bigger because we were there a good chunk of the day and then um there is a place called bowed up next to it which has bow buns and i love it because they also have like a little booth at the stadium and i'm obsessed with it so i wanted to go because it's like the actual location is right next to thinkery so i wanted to go with the kiddos delicious however i do think it got me sick i'm not gonna lie but regardless it was still very good so for doing the dishes i have this little sticker from once more love i thought it was very cute for going to Thinkery, another like paper shire sticker um, painting. They have painting at Thinkery. I think it's cute. That works. And then for bowed up, these are, I think these are dumplings. I don't think these are bow buns, but it's from SPC and it works. Um, we also went to this place called Lick, which is an ice cream shop parlor that's also close to Thinkery. So we, the kiddos got ice cream. Not all of us got ice cream. And then on the way home, we stopped at Target because we needed some things. And... Ooh, exciting actually afterwards my okay so my brother is graduating high school this year I don't want to talk about it it makes me feel really old because my siblings are all ridiculously younger than me I was 11 when he was born and so for him to be 18 and graduating high school makes me literally want to cry um so I uh, we're going to that and so I booked our flights this day to California because that's where they live right now um, if you don't know, my stepdad is in the military. He's actually going to be out very soon. Like, his retirement is coming sooner than I can think. Um, but they're currently in California. And every time we go, which has been, this will be the second time. So, the first time we went, I was like, oh, I miss it. I lived in California for 11 months. And I'm, oh, it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Wish I could afford it. <laughs> so, I don't know how anyone affords it. It's so expensive. So, anyway. For the ice cream, that's from Once More With Love. For Target, I have the shopping bag and I have a shopping script from the foil bundle. But nevertheless, I am so excited to go to see my family. I have been missing them so much lately. It's gonna be so good. And then this plane, 
icon actually is from the foil bundle. So I thought that was perfect to mark booking our flights. And then I edited and uploaded a ton of videos this day because I was in like a good like getting ahead type mood and it was wonderful. And then since True Detective wasn't gonna be back on since we watched the first three episodes already, we decided to go ahead and get back into Silo. We stopped about halfway through. I think we stopped when Brian got his teeth removed extracted is probably a better term um so like we didn't really remember what like was happening but we came back to it silo was amazing the ending was fantastic brian bought me the box set of the books for what was this past holiday valentine's day he bought me the box set of the books for valentine's day and i'm so excited to dive into them but yeah silo is amazing the ending was fantastic and then i ended the evening by reading let's use solid because i haven't used a solid one Ooh, of this color yet Okay, so for editing and uploading all the vids, I have this Fox and Pip sticker, which I have not used one of those, these in a while, and it's super cute. This upload script is from Hannah, and that's from that same YouTuber sheet in silver. For Silo, I have a silver TV from SPC. I do, I do, I do have a custom Silo script from back when I we initially started watching it, so I was able to grab that again. That's from Hannah. And then for reading, I have a Once More With Love. This is like a smut sticker. Assassin's Blade is not smut, but <laughs> that works. And then this reading time is from SPC. What a good day. On to Sunday. So like I said, I think Bowed Up got me sick. Um, I was having a really bad nauseous night, wasn't feeling too great. And it subsequently, which has been my word of the day, but you don't know that yet because <laughs> haven't uploaded that vlog yet. But it subsequently created a chain of events that I would like to call my chest and I don't know what happened but I still don't really know the issue but we're taking it day by day so I was up pretty much all night not feeling too great uh having some tummy troubles stomach was killing me wasn't feeling great but I went to work um during work I counted the kit stock uh, I went through all the old kits and counted those the stock of that and I feel like it was really helpful so I'm gonna use I'm gonna use a flag to mark work this day. Yeah, we'll just do it like this. So for my stomach not feeling too great, this is from the Coffee Monsters Co. And then for working this day, oh, what did I say? I counted the kit stock and I collated a mystery. That's from Paper Shire. And I'm using the work script from the foil bundle. Then, okay, this is when I started watching Nottingham Forest. I do have scripts coming for it, so I'm not going to, um, write it in just yet but I did watch the Nottingham Forest game because Gio, it's a long story Giorena on loan there I'm just watching whenever he plays if he plays you know it's been real fun um had McDonald's for dinner why did I use light pink I should have used purple that makes more sense huh purple but I already have ah oh, bummer okay I can use this one for the forest game because I'm getting a script anyway um, we had McDonald's. Okay, that makes more sense. I was like, what's happening? McDonald's goes this way. And then I was having the start of my intense chest pain. I didn't know at the time if it was anxiety or not. So I wrote anxiety with a question mark. It was not anxiety. If it was anxiety, it would have went away. It's a long story. Um, I'll tell it, I guess, as the weeks progress. But as it started, it just started off as really bad chest pain. It was like actually really bad stabbing, hurting. I was in a ton of pain, but I was persevering but we will write it in because it's important I guess to the story and then I did end the night by watching True Detective. Perf. So for the Nottingham Forest game I have the soccer ball doodle. For McDonald's I have the little Happy Meal foiled icon from the foil bundle which is extra cute and I have a custom McDonald's from Hannah. And then I have the worry munchkin from once more with love which literally makes the most sense and then for true detective i have another silver tv from spc and another true detective script how cute okay so that is it y'all let me clean this all up kind of i'm gonna leave the hermione stickers out because i have to put those away but y'all need to see this full spread because it is to die for um it is so cute are you kidding are you kidding? Look how beautiful this spread is. I'm obsessed, 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 obsessed. I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. That's so beautiful. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.